Okay, hey, hey guys, um, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's such a weird time to film. I know I have, you haven't seen me like a hot minute. Uh, you know, I don't even have excuses, but I'll make another video for that. But this one is like a day in a life, but not really a day in a life because it's part of my day. So it's exam season when I'm fin finishing this, when I'm filming this. So like, I think it's the 18th of January and I have two exams. Because I had two modules semester one. So I, had, I took transport modeling and safety, and then I took project economics and management. So today I have my transport exam. So I thought, oh, cool, let me vlog it. Obviously, I wasn't, I'm not going to vlog everything because I have an exam to do, but like, it's an open book exam and we have eight hours. Bear in mind, some students in the University of Southampton do have closed book exams, like in person exams, and those are normally two hours. But this one's open book, we have eight hours to do it. I've properly revised, like, here's my revision. I mean, it doesn't look like a lot, but like, a lot of this was like qualitative, more discussion based type things, or like, but <clears throat> yeah, revised. Um, it's currently, I have no idea what the time is actually. Alexa, what's the time? It's 8.49 a.m. according to Alexa. The exam starts at 9. I don't look that nervous because, I don't know, I feel like I just want to like, get it done. Like, you know when you rise so much to the point where like, at this point I'd rather just sit the exam. Anyways, we'll see. Um, so it's 8.49, I need to find my phone. Found my phone. Um, first things first. Okay, so I don't actually think I've shown you this desk setup, but it's like similar to the one I what have I? No, either way, I have a monitor because when I had like my summer placement, which you've all seen the video, I had like three screens and then going back to one screen for universe, I was like, I'm not doing that. Anyway, so this is like my laptop and then this is my monitor. Um, these are my notes for the other exam I have on Monday, so I can move those away. I need pens, loads of pens. I don't even need highlighters. It shouldn't be highlighting anything. I mean, I think I might print the exam paper off and my snack i mean it's eight hours but it's not going to take me eight hours like if you were to just sit the exam in person it would be two hours so i'm banking on doing it in well i'm not going to say a time before you see me in the like the seventh hour struggling but banana and gold bar because they're my favorite snacks um i have my water butter um i'm gonna log in now because it's really like game time baby a quick brief of what transport management and safety is. I quite enjoy this topic. I mean this module like it's an optional module and fourthly you can pick like five optional modules or four Either way you can pick a lot of optional modules. So I chose this one. It's a semester one module and like we had like a lot of like urban traffic management um, Intelligent transport systems. We had a 50% coursework on this. So this exam is 50% So I submitted a coursework like last week I think and then this exam is 50% and then it will just give us an overall grade. And then our uh, essay was like a 50% essay about like intelligent transport system so we had to just choose one city or one inter corridor um road and then write about how we can improve like something a transport issue like an its system like i chose congestion charges in delhi and it was so interesting like learn about delhi's transport system and all the like issues that could possibly be fixed if they implemented like congestion charges like the like london and stockholm but yeah that was cool um yeah i think what i'm gonna do is like i'll break it hourly i'll like every hour or like i'm gonna read the exam but i'll give you my thoughts then jump straight to it because like i need to do the exam then if i'm in a comfortable place i will like give you like oh this exam is going <coughs> cut the cameras or like yeah it's going all right i'm, I'm I'll, I'll be finished soon all of that and then i'll give you the aftermath of the exam and i explain how exams work and which type of exams i find hard, harder in my engineering degree and all that rubbish but yeah i'll see you guys i'll see you later Uh, I'm just gonna quick, do a quick update before because I'm gonna now start this. But basically, we have four questions. We're supposed to answer three of them. Each question is worth a hundred mark, which is wild. And one question could be like a one of the questions is just a hundred mark question on a discussion, which is basically just submitting another essay. But the essay we did, we had like a month and a half to do it. This time, they're only giving us like eight hours. And then a couple questions that there's oh, I knew the maths was gonna be in there, so I think I'm gonna start with question four. But then it's just like a hundred marks because you can't go by like, you know, when 10 marks means like give like five detail points, two marks each, a hundred marks. Like, I don't even know how much I'm supposed to write for you to award me a hundred marks in a question. That seems very unfair and I will not be doing that question. But yeah, bye. Oh my days. Okay, so 
this is the two hour mark i said i was going to do hourly but then i lied i think i'm doing it by question because i didn't realize each question was basically 100 marks 100 marks because kind of weird you can't really like gauge like oh this is 20 marks but this same 20 marks is the same 20 marks of the calculation which takes about five minutes to do and that write-up took about an hour i don't know man i'm like one question is like almost 1300 words and I think I probably will probably need, it says, you know when they say estimated two to three hours, that's a lie, man. And I probably revised that, I'm just using my notes and I can't bother to like do all the Googling and referencing rubbish because like, my notes are quite detailed, but so far so good. Like besides like, it's just boring, like exams are just boring. Like that's the only downfall, like it is what it is. So um, the, the first, this question was all about like traffic safety. So how we can measure it. So there's this thing called like specific, that is, I lied, I lied. There's this thing called safety performance function, which basically like relates like road factors into like how safe the road is. And then that's like the only calculations, any maths bit in this like module. It's like all like statistical analysis and regression and the Poisson equation. Anyways, I've done that. So now I'm gonna go, we have four questions. We get to choose three. Um, so now I'm gonna go see one of the questions a hundred mark and I'm avoiding that one because like how would you even gauge how much to write for a hundred mark question like what does that even mean anyways I'll see you guys in the next hey guys I'm checking in on the I think it's like the three hour mark or whatever I was just really hungry so I have like um, what's called fried egg and toast because that's what I can make you know what they don't cater in the fact that you know you need to pause for lunch for dinner for breakfast but um, so far so good. I wouldn't say this exam's super hard. It's just more like you have to apply the knowledge that you've learned in lectures, which is what exams are meant to do. But yeah, I remember some question two out of three. And then I know I complained about the 100 marker like a couple minutes ago, but I'm gonna do the 100 marker because like, even though it's dumb, because you can't really gauge what 100 marks mean in terms of like quantity. And if you're saying this takes a two to three hour, exam then surely you can't expect me to write an essay like a full-on blown essay um but since we have eight hours i'm gonna use the whole eight hours because why not but yeah i'm gonna do the 100 marker essay basically because i actually don't understand the other question and there's no point in me choosing that well yeah um just do your revision guide and you'll be fine i'm gonna eat my food now so i'll see you guys later He knows where all the traffic walkers are. He knows which traffic walker is. He knows where to park for the le least probably to get a fine. Um, he knows all the cut throughs between buildings. This guy, I spent some time, this guy knows every single nine digit code to get in every tablet. Get in that, get in the door, four nine, four nine, table, straight in. He knows plan. He knows every security guard. When he goes to the building, what job are you doing? Straight in. There's no signing in because they know it. So these people are priceless in terms of efficiency. So a new driver is free. <coughs> so I'm on my last question. I had to take a break and get a yogurt because I was like, I was losing the will to live. No, I wasn't. Well, I was. Well, I was just tired. But now, I have my yogurt. I don't want to eat yet because I want to finish this, read it, and then submit this. It's just 5 p.m. It's 2 p.m. No, it's 3 p.m. For like, actually, another hour of just bashing out the last question. It's basically an essay question. Just write that down. Do a couple proofreading. But realistically speaking, in an actual exam, you don't ever have time to proofread. But I'll be lucky to complete all the questions, yet alone me reading the whole thing through. Plus, this document's gonna be like 5,000, 6,000 words and there's no way I'm using this. In the time that I'm left, lay. Anyway, I lied. I need, I need to let the energy out before I stop writing this essay. Oh, I can't lie to you. Over X's, but my heart's too broken, bro. Ask me why did I ever do that? Don't ride me. First thing on the bro like I'm ready to now tackle the last question. I'll see you guys in 50 minutes because that's how much i'm giving myself to write this essay realistically speaking i already have all the notes and i already know what to write so it shouldn't be taking that long to write it um so yeah i'll see you guys later so don't miss me too much i think the beauty of this is that you can just see visually me getting tired 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 like i have zero energy and i have weightlifting in the evening but oh my days i think i'm done like i've i don't think i'm done i am done i've answered all the questions currently sitting at 5,000 words well 5,000 5, I'm so sorry my brain is going so slow like even the, the articulating words seems to be a struggle either way I finished this but like bro in what world would this have taken you two to three hours tell me 
tell me like i promise you even if like you knew all the topic like i this was a thoroughly revised module but there's just no way you could have written all this and i think what happens with open book exams you kind of compensate for the fact that it's open book and you feel like you need to write more but realistically if you were doing this in the exam you wouldn't be writing in this much detail you'd make sure you get the points but all these like filler words all these filler sentences you would never really do and you most times you run out of time you just bullet point it but i think it's because you have you know it's open book you think oh rah maybe they want me to like write it or like essay type but this is not really an essay based subject either either way i feel like i did five thousand words too many but i answered it um so now i need to save this in pdf and then submit it it's 4 4 37 it's due at 5 p.m but like they said submit it 30 minutes before but um look at that it's not it's 30 minutes before and i haven't submitted it oh well i need to find a link because there was a link just imagine if your laptop like, i had to put that auto save on imagine if it just deletes it and that's your grade finished i just didn't really know what to do in that point <laughs> hey guys it's so weird when i started this video my hair was up the sun was out and now i'm well it's dark and i'm tired um but yeah i finally submitted it hence why my laptop's closed thank you for coming with oh okay so thank you for watching this vlog i'm gonna go now because my head hurts um more videos to come i'm so sorry for the inactivity but i'll explain that in a later video but like thank you um wish me luck when i get these grades in february or march it'd be full it'll be so funny to watch this video because i'm gonna upload it before i get my grades and um you know it'd be cool to see the reason why i failed and no, i'm joking the reason why i got a 70 percent Anyways, thank you for listening to my video. Wait, no. Thank you for watching. Goodbye.